Okay, voila, I have a Super 8 sound transfer unit right now. So this is a 50 foot reel, so it's a test reel. And uh, gonna thread it through. Now, these are all bell and howl mechanisms. They have been updated, the guts of them, um, so that the claws last a lot longer because when they were originally made, they were not made for industrial use, but they have been, there's a lot of things here that have been done in the guts of this to make sure that this is up to the wear and tear of constant transfers. Um, okay, so I'm gonna turn this on right now. You can see the white of the screen there and right there and push this down. Okay, and there we have an image, and we have an image here. It's like Lake Powell-ish. Um, just gonna do that there. Now I'm gonna stop this, and you can see right now, there is no burning of the film because you've got the LED light source right here. It is cold to the touch, you can see it right there. And then if I take this off, I'm gonna be careful here. And boom, there's the guts right there. So there's the camera, there's the magnifier, and the gate is right there. And I'm gonna take this off again so you can take a look inside and kind of see the cool. Let's have a look here if I can creep in here. There's the image. Oops. Yeah, but that's the image right there. There is the camera and the LED is ooh, right there. So everything pieced together nicely and it just all works. Okay, let's have a look. I've got to screw all this back in, but I'm just gonna place it for now. Hopefully not break anything because anything that breaks is not cheap. All right, I'm gonna screw that in in a second. So I'm gonna turn this on. And I can, oh yeah, and look, you've got the framer there. So you've got framer adjustment. And there we go. And the exposure, bring that down. So there we go. And just to give you an idea, if I start to record this, it's recording right now. Give it a second. And it starts to create a file. Now, this has to be constantly monitored because this isn't something you just walk away because this can go to hell in a handbasket very quickly. Anyone that works for me that's operated these are just training galore because this film, if it gets wrecked, there's no going back. Um, and here we go. I'll stop this right now. You can trim the clip and there we go, and it will create a file that is, even though it's a 16 mil, it's actually, and there we go, it's captured. And there we go. Not the best quality stuff I've seen, but you know, it gives you an idea of everything there. And uh, I'll move on to Super 8 Sound next.